Good afternoon, TikTok. All right, 2001 Hyundai Elantra towed in. Um, car is a crank, no start, and we have an immobiliser light flashing now. I'll just bring all the tools out. Um, we'll show you what we've got here fault wise. There is a P1805, which is an immobiliser EEPROM error, as you can see. So, straight off the bat, we're going to go with an immobiliser issue, obviously, considering we've got a crank no start. Um, first things first key coil test so this is basically a coil with an LED in it um, this is going to be hard to do one-handed but all we do with that is we're going to put our key in there and this will make sure that our key coil is functioning and when I turn that on you should see that flash so that means that the coil is not open circuit um, does not mean that the key's good or the wiring's good but it does mean that the coil's functioning so right there we don't we're not worried at this stage about an issue with the key coil. Um, and we're going to move on from that test and we're going to start looking at this key possibly. All right, so my key tester is on charge because the battery's flat. Um, don't let your tools go flat. Anyway, I'm going to continue with this and while that charges up, um, we're going to read the immobiliser pin code. Now, there is two keys learnt to this system, so there is keys in there whether this is one of them or not. Who knows? Um, it is possible at some stage it had a new key and then whoever owns this found this old key and it's been programmed over so what I'm going to do is follow through the steps on the Autel and we're going to read the pin code. Alright so right now I'm just programming this initial key in so that's our pin code, that's correct and we are going to follow through the steps, yes, programming succeeded, no I do not have a second key at this stage, one key successfully. So now what we're going to do is we're going to make sure that our IMO light goes off. We don't have an immobiliser light now, which is good, but we still have a crank no start. So I'm going to keep looking into this. Alright, and just to show that our immobiliser issue is all sorted, we are doing a IMO system rescan quickly. And as you can see, we've got one key that's learnt, so that's the one that we just programmed back in, this original one. Um, engine computer's learnt, everything else is all good. All right, so just on basic checks, um, I can hear, if I put the key on, I can't hear a fuel pump at all. Same cranking, we still can't hear a fuel pump, so. And that's the next thing I'm going to look into. We've got no other faults to go off, so we're going to start checking that fuel pump. Off.